All right, Croc fam, man, y'all already know, man, before I go, I got to show y'all that work. I got to show y'all, you know what I'm saying, what's going down, man. This palette I'm finna show y'all, man, it's something new. It's something fun. It's something exciting. And, man, I got a special guest with me today, man, the boss of the house, man, my baby, Jessica, man. For Croc fam, man, this right here, this Jessie, or oh, y'all can call her Croc mommy, man. It don't matter. Anyone, man. And when y'all in the city, man, just style me, man. Anytime I get you right, man. Baby is official with the hands, man. It go down. I'm talking about any style you want, anything you trying to do. She'll split the wig, man. She'll show you what it is, man. Talk to him one time. So I usually don't do all the talking. He do it. I'm real shy. Um, but yeah, I master in braiding hair. Um, I just showed y'all my Instagram, so you can go check it out. But uh, I'm going to let him finish doing the talking. Because <laughs> I'm shy like my kids. Man, look, y'all. I've been ready to see what's going down with this style right here. Man, if you don't know what we talking about, the siren, chain claw, New style, you know what I'm saying? That Crocs just been brought, man. I'm digging what they doing right now. You see what's going down, man. They real 70s. New style in your collecto as well. I think you got like, what, about 31, 32 pairs, something like that. Oh, these boys right chill, man, is official. For the ones that don't know what we got in front of us, let me pick them up. I ain't gonna lie, they lighter than what I thought they was gonna be. For the ones that don't know, man, these is the new style, the siren, chain, clogs, know what I'm saying? They came in regular too. They got the regular joints as well, but these right here is the chain additions, man. Y'all see the chains is popping. These right here is them cherry joints, man. You see what's going down. Man, your boy is excited like they minds, man. <laughs> them boys is fire! Man, dancing, dancing, dancing. I think I need to get me some of these, man. These boys right here is super duper fire, man. Croc fam, I want to know, like, man, who all dived in on these joints right here? These joints right here is super duper fire, man. Your boy loving them, man. Let's talk about these a little bit because off first hand, what I'm seeing right now is, man, Croc's been doing some, uh, some things, man. What they've been doing lately is I noticed, like, with all the high fashion brands that's been dropping, They've been letting them hit them across the head, you know what I'm saying, with the high designer prices and Crocs been spending the block and coming back, you know what I'm saying, basically with the same styles, just a little spin on it because what I'm getting from this, I'm kind of getting Balenciaga slash the beach, uh, the beach slide joints that they had, kind of getting that vibe, you know what I'm saying, just with the added feature right there just to give that heel vibe. And, man, these boys right here, man, I ain't going to care. These right here, five baby. They comfy too. I think they're like three, three and a half inches. But compared to my bay clogs that I have, these are way more comfortable. And you wouldn't think that they're comfortable because of how how the heel is. But they're real comfy. I wish I would have got pink though instead of. I like this color, but I have a lot of clothes with pink in it. And if I y'all, I was trying to figure out what I'm gonna put on to go with these, and I really didn't have nothing this color. But I just threw a shirt on. But, uh, yeah, these are real comfy. Real, real comfy. It don't feel like you have heels on when you're walking in them. So, basically, you want the pink one, too. Yeah. Give me some pink ones. Man, these boys these were, right they, here. They're real comfy. And, and they lightweight. They got, the iconic, they got the iconic comfort on them. So, yeah. they must definitely. They're real comfy. I feel a, I like feel a squish in them. And, uh. I was real anxious to see like what the inside of them was gonna look like as far as just like the uh heel. I was trying to see like like how to like the downhill structure is it, it like it feel like you walking flat. It, it feel it like you feel, walking flat? Yeah, it don't feel like you because I was no. kind of like sort of thinking like when you walking in the shoe, you kind of like feel like you just like Nah, and that's that's why these so comfy because when you wear heels, 
you know, you standing up on your tippy toes and these don't feel like it because it had a thick platform sole on it. So any, really any platform heel that you wear that kind of matches the height, you know, all the way through like this, it's, it's going to be comfy. But these, these don't even feel like, you, it don't feel like your feet are like falling in. It feel like you're walking I feel a com up. I feel a comfort in them, man. And that's right there. I ain't going to lie. The comfort most definitely is a 10 out of 10. And you know, like, they're going to go with the iconic comfort for sure because the iconic is just like that foam on top of a foam and it just give off that squish vibe. You know what I'm saying? And I'm digging these chains on here. I will say with the chains, you have to be real careful because I was walking earlier and let me see this one. When I was walking, the heel of it smashed down like this and the chain broke apart. But is you able to snap it back on? It's a part, right? You probably show you in the close up, but I can't really. What is like a, a snap on, a snap off type deal on that? Yeah. So the chain is removable on these? I don't know about the jimmy, but see, it's a it's a small slit right here. Oh, so it's a so snap. whenever I was looking at it, I kept seeing like how did it break off? Because it don't look like it broke off anything, but all you have to do is just snap it back in. So if you walking outside or you know, it tend to fall off, you can snap it right back in easily. I noticed on off. these two. Just dead. just her showing us that with the chain part, the whole little chain deal. I don't know if this, yeah. I noticed and for the ones y'all seen the removable uh strap video that I did, like you can remove the straps on these. You can put yeah, straps on these. Idea. So you could put you could put a whole strap on these or you could take them off. Chain like know what I'm saying? I, I kinda noticed that when you was dangling with the chain. I was scared because I thought I broke them and I was going to have to put it. So that is so that is like a gibbet right there. The chain is like a gibbet. So you can play them regular if you want. You know what I'm saying? Or you can snap that chain back on. Uh, that's dope that that's removable right there. And you just kind of just snap it back in. And the hose is not really tough. You know what I'm saying? It's like as far as like the uh, clog, like the classic clog hose, like... That was that pretty easy to pop in, pretty easy to pop out. And man, let's go ahead and get that close up for them. I gotta see these with the flash on them so they'll see what's going down. Gotta let the people get the flash on these right here. Put the light on for y'all so y'all can see. Look at them boys right there, man. Look at them boys right there. And these is the size seven. She wear a women's eight. seven. What seven and eight? A women's eight, but we always get a women's seven Six. in most yeah. of the clothes. Well, she get a women's eight in like the classic, the classic joints that like, remember when I told y'all like the classics tend to run small on certain collabs. So she'll get like an eight on them, but I knew with these, to just go with a size seven on these joints. You see that iconic that comfort on that gut. See what's going down with these boys right here. Cherry joints, that chain on there. And like I said, that chain is removable. All you gotta do is pop it out on the inside. Chain is removable. See what's going down. Cherry chain to match. Look at that heel. That heel, like how many inches you'll say off the I ground? I think it's three. About three, a three good, and a half. Uh, I probably should look that up. About a good three and a three. I think it's like, I think they taller than the Mega Crushers look like. That heel most definitely. That's probably uh, their tallest crop. That heel most definitely taller than the Mega Crush. Do I got a Mega Crush that we could look at? See, do yeah. I got a mega crush? Three, it's a three point six inch heel. See if I got so, a mega crush. Almost, almost four feet. I think I got a mega crush. I said almost four feet, almost four inches. Pass me that mega crush right there on your back right, the black one. So we got a mega crush right there. That he done well with the tag still on. So let's see, let's line them up. Cause I think them, yeah, they 
They most definitely a little higher. You see, they most definitely a little higher. So, them boys, I'll say like a good three, what, three off the ground? Man, that's crazy right there, man. That's crazy right there, man. And you see these boys right here just giving full 70s vibes. See what's going down with these boys right here. The detailing all the way through. And like I said, they giving Balenci vibes. They giving Balenci vibes for sure. And that's real good, though, that Cross came through because I know a lot of people that wanted to get the Balenci, uh, the, the heel joints and these right here, the platform joints and just the beach slides and all that. So for them to come through with these joints, you know what I'm saying, at a good price, and it's pretty much the same swag, kind of like with the boots. You're pretty much getting the same deal, you know what I'm saying, just minus the uh, the name on it, but pretty much the same thing. And it's still Crocs, so, man, the comfort is there, man. Y'all see what's going down with these boys right here. I ain't going to cap, man. I'm ready to see you get these on the feet right here, man. Let's go ahead and get them siren claws on the foot. Okay, man, y'all see what's going on, Croc fam, man. Them boys right there is super duper fire, man. Them super duper electric joints. Yes, man, give me looks, man. Give me a spin around. Yes, yes. That's it right there. Uh, I like it. Okay, man, let's talk size and Croc fam. She wear a size seven in women's and classics. We tend to go up to a size eight. Know what I'm saying? I was figuring with the height, know what I'm saying? For me, I'm a size 12 with the everything that I got that's off the ground, I went down a size, know what I'm saying? Just because, you know, if you got that little extra room while you up in the air, it's just too much going on, too much sliding around. So I decided to just go with the seven and it looked like I guessed it right. What you thinking about the size seven? I like it because I don't, like I said before, I don't like a lot of space between the back of my heel, my heel in the back of the croc. So these fit perfect. My toes are not like smushed at the front. So just flushed in that perfect. Yeah, it's good. I feel like if I got an eight, I would have been slipping and sliding. So most definitely get whatever size that you stick, that you, that fits. And remember, like I told y'all once before croc fam, when you dealing with the platform sizes, it's all really a personal preference thing because like some do uh, tend to go up a size just to get that extra room. I feel like it all depends on like how you walk with height. You know what I'm saying? I know for most, it'll be like that snub type feel just to feel your foot and just to feel your planting. You know what I'm saying? When you walk and you don't want to have one of them offset type deals where you damn near break your ankle or something like that. So you most definitely want to have that snub, but something that still fits comfortable, you know what I'm saying? I'm still saying the comfortable. I'm still saying like a pinch, you know what I'm saying, of space right there to play with on the backside. You know what I'm saying? The toes is looking like they flush right, man. The chains is popping right there, man. Y'all see the glisten and the glamour on the chains. Like I said once before, you can remove the chains on the, on the other ones, the regular siren clogs. I don't know if they got holes on the side, but if they do, that pretty much give you an idea of what you could pretty much do with this clock. Like you can add like your own straps or you can add like your own gibbets on the side. Just, would, just something to try, play with. If uh, I would try and do like a, a Bratz, you know, the Bratz dolls. Like the Bratz dolls. These, that's what these shoes remind me of. The girls know what I'm talking about. So what are we talking? Gibbets? We talking accessories? Yeah, gibbet, gibbets uh, and accessories. You know, with like some gold. You can get like some Bratz dolls and put them on there. You know, like some, um, the little lightning bolts. Speaking of gibbets, this right here, this particular style, as far as gibbets, is giving me like the jewelry style like type gibbets, know what I'm saying? Not nothing plastic, know what I'm saying? Like more on the stylish side, like the chains and just like the pearls and what have you. Just the extra little glitter and glamour that's going to give them that pop, know what I'm saying? And this will probably be a pad that I give my daughter as well because I'm kind of seeing a style as far as just like meshing the flare jeans up with them as well, just giving it that 70s pop. Man, I'm really loving this new style right here that Crocs brought. You know what I'm saying? Not really more so of a new style, but just let's say a remix style because Balenci did kind of do some things like this. Crocs just pretty much took it, kind of gave it a little heel, put a little split on it. Gave it that vibe, man, but also just keeping that comfort as well. 
man, this path right here for me, most definitely just on the outside looking in, I'm going to have to give them a solid 12 out of 10. You know what I'm saying? I want to see some more from this clog right here. Hopefully they do some collabs. You know what I'm saying? Like a Ruby Rose or maybe like a, a, a Vera type collab, something that's going to give it that, that, that jewelry, that dressy, you know what I'm saying? That preppy type vibe for y'all to really just do y'all thing. You know what I'm saying? For y'all can really just look electric, but man, what we thinking about these crock fam? I'm really digging these right here. What you going with on the right on these? What you'll give them just off the glance? A 10. Mm. I, I give you, it's, it's above 10. I say 15. A solid 15 out of 10. If I, solid. A solid 15 out of 10 crock fam. There you go. There you have it, man. The Cyrus. Once again, man, I want to know, like, who all came through with them good old siren chain clogs? Did you get the regular siren clogs? I think they came in bone. They came in pink. And if I'm not mistaken, I think they came in uh, black. You know what I'm saying? And they got, uh, they got a platinum color, too. I don't know if that's on Zappos or if that's on the Journey site. But, man, you got to get them joints right there, man. Them boys are super electric. They giving the 70s vibes. You know what I'm saying? Them boys is... Gonna be some classics, know what I'm saying? I'm curious to see where they gonna head, know what I'm saying? As far as the collabs, we'll see what's going on. But, man, in the meantime, man, drop down in the comments, man. Let's talk about them good old siren joints, know what I'm saying? Them chains, Jill. All right, Croc fam, man, y'all all 